So now press configure, then it will take you to the settings. So you need to go to profile, scroll down to new profile, and then go to portal setting, and then portal URL. Now go all the way down to the right, and then press OK, and then delete, not all of it, but until here. Now you type in the URL that we're going to send you. So you phone us up and we'll give you the username. So you type that in, dot com. This is just a random number just to test it, okay? So uh, that's it. So once that's done, you press next. Then you press OK. And then you press the back button three times. One, two, three. Then you scroll down to save and restore settings. Then you press again, save settings and profile. And then you press save setting and profile again. After that, you press OK. And then you press back, back, all the way back until you see the blue screen. Once you see the blue screen, now you're ready to watch the channel. So you press the three line button on the remote. So the three line button should be there. You see it, right? Three line button, press that. And then go to profile. And then you see the new profile now. So you press on it and then it should load. Because we have the wrong portal, it won't work. So your portal should automatically load up. If you need help, contact us or email us. Follow us on Facebook.